big, big wins. And let's go down to Jemai. All right, thank you very much, Dan. Well, Romy, that's you guys' first come from behind victory this season. How satisfying is it to be able to accomplish that? I mean, it's huge. You know, anytime you can get a win, especially in this fashion, it's incredible. What are you thinking there as you come to the plate? You got Connor Wong speed at second base. What are you trying to do in that situation? Honestly, there's no outs there. You know, just trying to put the ball in play, get the runners over. You know, it hits a bonus. You're coming off the bench in this game. How did you manage to stay game ready and be able to come in in that instance and be able to deliver? I mean, you know, we do a great job with the coaches in between innings and stuff, getting ready, getting as warm as possible. So, you know, credit goes to them for getting us ready for sure. I think that was your second time at first base in your big league career. How do you think you fared this time around? Oh, uh, man, I wish I would have came up with that pick that Rafa threw me. You know, I wish I would have made that play for him, but I got the win, man. That's all that matters. All right, Romy, congratulations for the win. Thanks so much for the time. Appreciate it. All right, Obi, walk-off win for the Red Sox. Back upstairs to you. All right, Jemai, thank you. The Red Sox win presented by Morgan and Morgan, America's largest injury law firm. And one more look at the shot down the line to win it. Yeah, this is what we talk about, too, just putting the ball in play, make good things happen. Big Romy Gonzalez get the game winner. Three hours and 12 minutes in front of 32,893. The Red Sox pick up a victory over the Tampa Bay Rays in this series even at 1-1 with two more to go. TC and Jim coming your way.